Hey, listeners. Thanks for joining us for your daily Bible verse. We hope you enjoy this deeper look at one of your favorite or maybe not so well-known Bible verses. To get all of our episodes straight to your phone, just subscribe to this podcast on iTunes or wherever you listen to your podcasts. To find more Bible studies, Bible reading plans, and verses by topic, we'd love for you to visit us on BibleStudyTools.com. Walking in Sustainable Faith by Meg Booker, read by Ellie Johnson. As a result of this, many of his disciples withdrew and were not walking with him anymore. John 6, 66. Can you picture the scene? After Jesus preached that he was the only way to the Father, earth-shattering and, in the minds of those who did not believe he was the Messiah, blasphemous speech. It was too much for many to wrap their minds around. And I believe that's where they went wrong. Our minds will never be fully capable of comprehending Jesus. Faith kicks in to cover what we cannot comprehend. We are purposely not privy to all of the answers, but that doesn't mean we can't live a life full of tremendous purpose God has intentionally placed upon all of our lives. It's all in how we walk, where we walk, and who we follow. The original translation of walked in this verse is peripateo, meaning to make one's way, progress, to make due use of opportunities. We walk in the life of our steps. Jesus had already made clear what discipleship meant, and many were not ready to receive life in the way he taught. There are many rounds of pain we are promised to go through in this life. Rounds of physical pain, mental pain, relational pain, and tests of our faith. God is not surprised by any of them. What will we choose to do in each round? Will we remember that he's in our corner and continue walking? Continue fighting on in faith with him at our side? With the Son and the Spirit that He sent to help us and build a bridge into His arms every day we are alive? Or will we walk away from the fight? Will we turn around when it's too much for us to understand, bear, or carry? Life is too heavy for our backs, but fits perfectly in His arms. Let's pray. Father, we praise You for carrying us through pain. Thank You for Your faithfulness and compassion for us. Forgive us for walking away, making life harder to bear. Remind us in the moments when life seems impossible that it is. And that's why you are the only one capable of carrying us throughout it. In Jesus' name, amen. Hey everyone, thanks for listening to Your Daily Bible Verse, a production of the Salem Web Network. If you enjoyed what you heard today, We'd love for you to head over to iTunes and rate and review our podcast. It really does help people find us. This episode was produced by our managing editor, Kelly Givens, and recorded and edited by Stephen Sanders. Be sure to come back tomorrow as we examine more of God's Word.